All right, morning everybody. Headed down to Kyrgyzstan. So this morning, I maybe locked my laptop to a table and maybe lost the keys. <laughs> or maybe somebody else lost the keys. That yeah, was you. It's unclear how the keys were lost, <laughs> I'll just be honest. Um, and then my watermelon prank on Chris yesterday has now backfired in a prank on myself because now we have about a half hour to leave and I have this and that watermelon to eat. So um, I'm going to be well hydrated today. This is going to be fun. Five hour drive in a taxi with no bathrooms. We're not going to worry about the five hour drive in a taxi with no bathrooms just yet. Oh, we're stopping. We're stopping. This is going to be fun. Finally got a driver. Took about an hour. A lot of translation issues. And Google Translate wasn't working. A lot of hand signals. Turns out our original plan to go to Tokmok was flawed because foreigners can't cross at that border. So we're going to Bishkek anyway where we didn't want to go, but that's okay. Son of a Bishkek. You know, only president former president got arrested in Kyrgyzstan, now he's being charged with murder today uh, for the special forces guy who got killed, which was unfortunate and concerning at the same time. But um, our driver, Mars, is going to meet us in uh, Kordai and we're going to cross the border. We'll see how that goes. You guys excited? Yeah, it's going to be great. Good day. Need a nap. It's only 11. Hey, sorry to interrupt, but uh, it's your favorite. I hate your keys. Saying you look like an old Chinese woman. Did you need a white person pack? Watermelon. I hate you. There it is, just across the Kyrgyzstan border. We're carrying all of this. Yeah, it's fine. It wasn't a bad put in. Oh, shush. Sure. It's longer you, than a put in. You can't use those words when you're not on the river. So now we're just uh, waiting for our driver, trying to get some cell service, which we have none. So that's pretty cool. Another another challenge of Central Asia. So everybody excited? Woo! We made it. It's Kyrgyzstan. So what we think is a beer. Got some tea. Got some tea. Fanta. Lots of lemon and honey. Yeah. What the banana thing is. Those were the things that I recognized. There was something that looked kind of like a peach, but may not have been. I don't know what that is. I don't know. That, that could be anything. Chris seems to believe that this is an orange delight, but the bee, I don't know. That's just a vanilla cream bar. Ooh. It's not sour though. What do you got? It's honey, I think. Mm. You got honey outside and then. Sort of. Is that a thing? Oh, there's a trash can. So they have a Hey, 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 Trevor. Trevor. You see all the. You see the watermelons? Hey, Chris. Hey, 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 watermelons. When we first got to Kyrgyzstan, I didn't exactly know what I was expecting, but it was very different than I anticipated. And the whole country is just a land of really stark contrast with huge rivers and dry creeks and 
dry, arid lowlands with these soaring mountains and glaciers sitting on top of them. After seeing Kazakhstan and the difference between the two countries, Kazakhstan seemed almost overly developed, and Kyrgyzstan had a much slower pace of life, which was a little bit more charming, especially when we got to our guest houses. Shoes off, everybody. After the last toilet. <laughs> This one? Why you got a video of me? You guys both failed now. <laughs> Three Americans walk into a hotel. What is this? This is a kurda cold. It's fried potatoes with meat. <laughs> also, it's national food. Oh, that's good. So we're gonna go up, whatever this river is, Grigorevka. <laughs> Check it out tomorrow. We'll go Karakal. Cool. Maybe go raft it. I don't know. So it looks good. Big bushes. Well, we'll see what happens. <laughs> Thanks for joining us on our trip halfway across the world to Expedition Asia, exploring Kazakhstan and Kyrgyzstan. If you guys have questions about the trip, please drop those in the comments below. And if you want to go on the trip next year, I think we're going to be coming back because, I mean, you have to. Look at this place. So, drop us a comment. You can shoot us an email. Uh, we'll put a link down below that you guys can reach out to us. Um, and we'd love to have you out here. So please stay tuned for more Expedition Asia content and we will see you next time.